All right, guys, real quick before this playthrough episode, uh, I have another channel, Shofu TV. Uploading some funny stuff on there, so go ahead and check that out if you would like. Um, I'm at 890. I really want to get to 1,000, maybe even 2,000. That'd be great. And uh, yeah, so now we are going into the playthrough. Uh, right now, I'm going to go ahead and switch up my uh, experience share and give it to my DMAC, my Victini. And uh, oh, I forgot to introduce my boy Joker real quick. What's good? <laughs> What's going on? What's going on? Good to be here. Good to be here with my main man, Shofu. And, uh, you know, so right away, you already see what he's doing over here. He's got to go in this house, run around in the sand, talk to this fisherman, because, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You could teach a man, you could teach, you could feed a, give a man a fish, you teach him to fish, he's going to eat for a lifetime, so. <laughs> well, anyways, um, I'm just going to set up my shofu, you know, and then kick that fucking fish in its face a few times and kill it. Yeah, him and all of that. <laughs> get some experience. And I'm going to set up my peanut. And it evolved, so I'm supposed to name it Butter because PB and J Otter, but I didn't have time. I just, I guess, I, okay, I'm making excuses. I just didn't do it. Anyways, um, I'm gonna go for the grass knot, then the uh, I don't razor shell, and take out that fish. And uh, if I haven't, if you haven't noticed by now, this whole episode's gonna be sped up because you know I wanted to get as much done in as little uh, time as possible. So um, yeah. <laughs> so anyway, listen, Shofu just showed that. Who's boss? Um, didn't want to switch because obviously, you know, saying a low kick is going to handle this guy in two shots. So he bites him because you know those fishes are dirty; they're biters. But uh, after this, peanuts coming out because, like he said, he's talking about peanut butter otter, and I just was hungry. I wanted PB and J. <laughs> That's just me, though. But I don't know who this Pokemon is right here. That's my boy Zerua. Zerua not playing games. Zerua, <laughs> Zerua sounds like this girl I used to date. <laughs> I don't even want to get into that. But anyway, Zerua's getting low on health here. Yeah, Zerua just died. I got to go heal it up after this battle, actually. But uh, out that D-Max. That D-Max can go for that uh that that grass knot real quick. That knot, that trip, that Boy Scouts. Yeah. That, uh, <laughs> that Boy hey, Scout scouts on or be prepared, suckers. So yeah, this guy right here heals Pokemon up. So now we're gonna be on our way through the desert, find a great ball over here, talk to this lady. She can't see shit. Talk so. to this bitch in the parasol. <laughs> she got a parasol. She got a parasol, Joe. She got that Rihanna, that umbrella. Yo, <laughs> raining more than ever. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and kick. Okay, that thing's already dead, so there's no point. Um, go for the grass knot on this guy. I thought it would die in one hit, but it's actually not ground in water. It's just water. But uh, I'm gonna be able to kill it next, uh, you know, next turn, and then we're gonna be moving along. Gotta keep using them repels because I don't want to walk into Pokemon in the sand. Go over here, heal it one more time. Then we're gonna be on our way through the. Uh, I forgot the name of the place we're going, but yeah. Oh, look at, look at that! And and believe it or not, he ran into that crocodile from Happy Gilmore, the same one that bit off Chuck's hand. <laughs> <laughs> and you know that what we had to do to that crocodile beat his ass up. So then this worker comes out, and he sends out a Pokemon that, to my untrained eye, looks like an anus. Oh my gosh, it does. That po Yo! <laughs> that Pokemon, and your dude has a stick! And you know what he's gonna do with that stick! Why do you think it's super effective? Bitch! Po <laughs> bitch! Brrrat! <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, uh, Shelfu, you know, throwing rocks and shit at, at apparently assholes. And uh, here comes another one. Mm. Oh my gosh. It's More a... pussy, 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 pussy. Fucking bitches. Oh, I'm sorry for the language. Nah, it's all good, man. Kids watch it's all this good. show. Kids love this stuff. Anyways, uh, I'm going to go for the rock throw and I miss. How do I? Wow. Sand that's, attack. That's crazy. It's sand attack will do that, it every that's, time. That's sand attack, man. He hit me with two of them. Get hit with all that. <laughs> and he has one more Pokemon, and it's the same one as me, so I'm going to switch out go to my D Mac because D Mac is a psychic type. And hit him with that confusion, and it kills him in one hit. So now what, ho? He doesn't know. He's confused. <laughs> and they're, just, they're just workers everywhere, man. I don't even know. What Worker Shelby. Here. Shelby set out that that timber confusion. The D-Max is going to go for that confusion. Take it out. Easy. Easy. So um, we're going to go over here. Get this Torment. We're probably never going to use it. Uh, use one more repel. Now we're going to be on our way. Wandering around aimlessly. Use another repel. Fuck. And uh, now I'm going to go this way, talk to this dude, you know, he has nothing for me. Get a burn heal, talk to this camper, and this camper wants to get his shit pushed in real quick. So, uh, okay. What the fuck is that? It's a Darumaka, man. That thing is a boss. I think he falls into the thing on the bottom right hand corner. Ooh, <laughs> Darumaka. So, Don't yeah. worry, I got to Mr. Uh, Darumaka. Go to the left, get an either. 
Uh, use another repel. Talk to this backpacker. Whoa, that bitch needs to quit backpacking. <laughs> Don't ask me why. And then uh, she has a cotton knee. Doesn't really matter. Go for that incinerate. One hit KO. Yo, bitches. And now we're going to be moving along. Uh, yes. Headed to the... Uh, I forgot. What, I can't believe I forgot the name of the place. The Desert Resort? Something like that. And here's this freaking pedalo. About to get demolished by an incinerate. So now what? Get hit with all that. I thought it was pretty funny and simple. <laughs> all these backpackers, what are they doing here in the sandstorm? Oh, no. oh, this bitch got a zebra. Got a backward zebra. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, Joe? <laughs> I'm making purse out that bitch. <laughs> That's just me. Oh, oh, I know who this is. Who is I, this? Let me handle this. Because this is my boy, Worker Scott. Me and this guy do construction. And he likes gay, gay dudes. So he obviously has a gay ass anus Pokemon named Rag and Rolla. Rag and Rolla. Is a little lazy. I'm sorry. Anyway, wrong video. But he tries to do a mud slap, and Shofu, you know, he's about to get hit with all that. So he twists up his cane. He buried bombs that bitch with a rock throw 50 experience. Hit we out of here, baby. That. Switch it up to DMAC real quick because you already know that DMAC has that confusion that fucking hits you. One hit KO. One hit one wonder. Bitch! <laughs> and he gets the bread up. 720 for winning. I'll take all that money. Bitch. Another fucking worker, man. I'm tired of these guys. Oh, uh, yeah. DMAC's gonna hit him with that Confusion, though. That Confucius. That Confucius. <laughs> to be or not to be? That is the question. So now we're gonna move along. I don't know what's in here. Oh, this guy gives you Dig. You'd really need... If anybody who's watching this and playing along with it, go into this house and get Dig, because Dig is gonna help you in many situations. It's gonna help you get out of caves. It's gonna help you... Hide your bones. Uh, yeah, exactly. Hell, hide your bones. In the backyard, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You ever got a body you need to dispose of, you know what I'm saying? Somebody keep running their mouth at the club, you know what I'm saying? Use that dig, Joe. Okay, now this doctor right here, he has a solo assist, which is actually, I really need to catch one of these eventually. But uh, basically, this dude will heal, heal your Pokemon up after uh, you beat him, and he'll keep healing your Pokemon up afterwards, uh, no matter what, whenever you need it, so that's good. And just FYI, he looks like a Hello Kitty in a bubble. <laughs> that's just me, though. So now we're in the desert resort, walking around. Uh, I don't know why I didn't cut this battle out, hey, actually. one eye. He fucking bit Chuck's hand off. <laughs> That's that Happy Gilmore, if you guys recognize that. There's a lot more where that came from, too. Mm -hmm. So Backpacker, uh, I, forget, I didn't see his name anyway. Oh, Kelsey. Uh, Kelsey. Yeah. He's going to get... Okay, I'm going to get hit with that quick attack. That confusion's not going to take it out because, uh, you know, Tranquil is not, uh, you know... Is he fully evolved? No, no, no. This is the second evolution, I think. So, um, rock smash to the face, and you just got your face rock smashed. So now we're going to be moving along. <laughs> I said that to my ex-girlfriend, that's why she's my ex. Anyway, <laughs> um... Pick up the soft sand here. I'm actually going to give it to, uh... I'm going to give the charcoal to all of that, and then I'm going to give the soft sand to my guaca, just to power up its ground moves. Hey, you bit Chuck's hand. And then this dude... Hey, I fucking die. <laughs> anyway. Freaking sand... Ooh, what the hell? Ooh, we got those, uh, zen mode, uh... Darmanitan sitting outside the uh, castle Phil, here. Phil Jackson, baby, did a lot of LSD on the beach. Oh, that is a King Tut <laughs> up in this bitch. That's Sigalik right there. I would never mess with that Pokemon. <laughs> that is a cool looking Pokemon. It is. Wow, he just got a critical hit. That's Why gay. do you think he gets Cax? Because he knows the Pharaohs, bitches. <laughs> that but he rock. still gets hit with all of that. But my uh, peanut actually died during that battle, so I'm going to give it a revive, you know, power it back up. And we are going to... I shouldn't even be in here, actually, because I can't do anything yet. And this fucking blue bat comes out. And it looks stupid. cotton candy with bat wings. <laughs> Pokemon needs to get more creative. They're just really stoned eating cotton candy. Like, dude, if we put some bat wings on this and called it a fucking... I don't know what it's called, but yeah. They're just doing... No they're, it's just a bunch of nonsense. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah, my Zerula disguised as a... Okay, I'm gonna Ooh. fall through this fucking hole because quicksand and stuff. Find another revive, which is good. Uh, go for that repel, you know. Just walk around talking to people. Um, I can't even go past here yet, so it's kind of stupid that I went into this place. But, on the other hand, I can get a fossil from this lady, and she will give me the plume fossil, which will help me get the Arceus later on in the game. And Chia and stuff. Found a super potion. <laughs> Backpacker Elaine Bennis wants to battle, so he comes out with that Jerry Seinfeld, and he says, "What's the deal with all of that? I mean, you can't even get buffeted by a sandstorm." <laughs> that was my Jerry Seinfeld impression. But Fire Fang, <laughs> that was then, sound uh, effects. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm gonna 
switch up some items real quick, and then I'm gonna keep running around, uh, running along around the perimeter, looking for stuff to uh, collect, add to my collection. Beat this backpacker Liz ass real quick, and she has a freaking watchhog. That thing is a high ass rodent. With its, with its, <laughs> that thing looks like it smoked. It did. Look at those eyes. That took, thing took eyes redder than the, the devil's dick. <laughs> Sitting there with his arms crossed, like, bitch, I know you got more weep on me. <laughs> <laughs> So we're going to hit level 23, getting paper stacks real quick. Backpacker Nate, that's good, Nate. You can get hit with that water gun too. Ooh, Nate got that sturdy on his uh, his freaking yeah, level. But, but you also know that Nate is Nate Dog. Rest in peace to Nate Dog. Yeah, Nate Dog, man. Saying? Nate Dog died, guys. Yeah, rest in peace. So, uh, oh shit, computer slept on me. Anyways, uh, this freaking Gothita, this freaking Gothic ass Pokemon here. So gonna go for two water guns. Still doesn't die. Wow. And then he goes for embargo, which is pointless. And Peanut goes to level 24. So you know what that means. Yeah, 13 more levels until we have a. Okay, what the hell is going on here? What is this? Yeah. Well, that was awkward. That was a little minor editing, uh, typo situation, computer malfunction type thing. But anyway, it's all good because we're back and Peanut is back in action. And the first thing that's gonna happen is. All of that. About to wreck that your mask real quick. Go for that fire fang. One hit KO. What you know about it? That thing has a shit ton of defense, but all of that is just a heavy hitter. So it doesn't care. That's and true. Um, this, these are all truths. This freaking, freaking. I don't even know what the hell that thing is. That's Luna. a Luna. <laughs> Luna. That thing will eat your dreams. That thing should be named Freddy Krueger. That's not something that you want to fuck with. And you just got challenged by Indiana Jones. <laughs> da 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 da. Water gun. One shot KO. Suck on these nuts, Indiana. <laughs> but Guaca is about to go for that dig. That that, oh. that dig, man. And if you guys didn't notice earlier, uh, all of that just learned fire punch. So it's over. It's pretty much over for everything that stands in its way. So, um, yeah, one hit KO on all these motherfuckers out here. And, uh, Pokemon Dude, Ranger. you got, like, Indiana Jones bitch. <laughs> all, all she has is a blue duck. Like, it just waved at you. Look at that. It just waved. Hey, that thing gave me so much trouble, I couldn't even believe this thing. Um. How, what is this thing? It's a freaking duck. But look, it uses Feather Dance, so it lowers my attack by two stages. So I'm going to have to switch out, otherwise I'm not going to be able to kill it. Go to my Shofu, because Shofu got that rock throw. That, that, that rock throw. And my mama didn't teach me not to throw stuff at, at them. Anyways, um... Hey, if you live in... <laughs> <laughs> don't throw stones if you live in a glass house. That's exactly. what they say. Of course, Aerial Ace is going to do nothing to Shelf because Shelf is a fucking brolic. And, um... Yeah, we're going to be moving along. And the thing about these rangers, they always give you a berry after you beat them. So, you know, they're kind of useful, but not really. Because berries are for pussies. And we're going to yeah. go over here and find Rock Tomb. So, um, yeah. Which is dumb, because if you would have just battled Brock and got your boulder badge, you would have already gotten him. Right <laughs> I'm still in fire red mode. My, my, my it's all good. It's all good. So, uh, we're going to fight this psychic here. And he has a solo sis, which I that. really That's a Hello Kitty in a fucking bubble. Look at that. <laughs> Hello Kitty just got one hit killed by that fire punch. Good. I don't like Hello Kitty. <laughs> I don't like bitches that rock Hello Kitty. And D-Mag doesn't like Woo Bat. So he loses. But this isn't my D Mac, it's my Zerua. Zerua's gonna hit him with that uh that uh that uh It's been nice <laughs> faint attack. So uh yeah, this is we're gonna wrap up the episode here. Uh say goodbye to Joker. Peace. It's been a re it's been a pleasure, sir. Subscribe, comment, like, and if you hit the dislike button, bitch, I'ma come to your house, I'ma knock on your door twice at twelve in the AM. That's midnight for all you illiterate bitches. <laughs> and I'ma come in your room. And in, you know, I'm, chance that. I'm going to go in your house at 7 in the morning right before you go to work. I'm going to piss in your Cheerios. I'm out. Now what? <laughs> Bitch.